Alrighty then, we are back. In the world of survival horror, and I totally didn't put my ink ribbons away. God damn it. <laughs> That's okay, we're just coming in here to get the key. Other than that, I think that's the only thing we need in here. I don't think there was anything else. Let's see. Okay, so we put these away. We'll take the keys with us. Mine throw. I feel like I want to save it for a boss. We'll bring the handgun, the shotgun, our keys, our ammo, and a healing item. This leaves us with three open slots, just in case. Which way is the right way here? Let's see, da, 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 da. I haven't been this way. Let's go this way. We cannot go that way, so let's go this way. We have a second floor to explore. Spiders. Six shots. Not bad. Not bad at all. Less shots if I can hit that red thing there. With the spiders near it. Perfect. What? Ah, they, they had babies. Can they poison me? I haven't been poisoned yet. Is there another door out of that area? No. Fixture that lights the hour plate of the clock. The hour plate? Fixture that lights the hour plate of the clock. What does that mean? There's a keyhole in the elemental copper plate. Will you use the clock T key? Sure. No longer need this key. Discard it. Yeah. Red herbs. Sweet. I think I have some greens I can combine them with. stuff over here we have some handgun ammo we have a silver gear yeah I saw a typewriter so yeah nice Let's see do I have any green herbs yes any more green herbs oh a bunch Exactly what we wanted. Alright, we're keeping our key. Our weapons. This is a very simple puzzle. I think they actually ripped this one off for RE2. The remake, I mean. Obviously, this came out after the original RE2. <laughs> Music box, elaborate ornamentation. There are switches marked 8F. Can you operate the switches? Hmm. 
Move it up or down? Oh, is this like a music note memorization? I am so terrible at music puzzles. I am completely tone deaf. very simple, the one that doesn't sound like shit. Ugh. I mean, even I can tell what... You know, my tone-deaf self can kind of... It's not even like the, just the notes, the notes just sound bad. I can't identify why, they just sounded bad. Kronos Chain, okay. Chain made to a door or a god of time. There's a small screw hole near the ornament. And it looks like a key, isn't that the time key thing? Gear made of silver. Key ornamented with a clock part. It has a screw-shaped ornament to put a round-shaped object. Oh! It's a key designed to adore a god of time. Oh, so you have to, like, build the key. Oh, okay. That's a neat thing. Alright, we have some gunpowder A. Maybe don't think we need any more handgun ammo at this point. We need higher power ammo, so let's save these for if we find more bees. I feel like it's worth more valuable to wait for it's higher power ammo. I don't need to save right now. See, I want to bring bigger guns with me in case Nemesis shows up. You know he's going to. I mean, obviously the gear goes in here. Beautifully ornamented gadget. All right, it wasn't letting me get out of there for a sec. All right, stop. There. Nothing happened. Hmm. So I probably have to do something with the gear. But with the Kronos key, I can probably go back and unlock that one door down the first floor. Alright, what are my options? Use the light, cut the cord. Cut the cord! Yep. Three first aid sprays. God damn, and it has three in it. Okay, that was worth it. That was worth the nothing I spent to get it. <laughs> hey, what's a light gonna do? Maybe line him. Is he back up? 
He's back up, isn't he? Yep. Oh wait. Well, maybe I don't need to. Oh, right. You just got it? Sure. I only spent all that time building it. Might as well just chuck it. I feel like this gun is going to make it a lot easier than the normal handgun would. Fire so fast. The face is twisted with an expression of pain. He seems to have died from poisoning. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I'm down to red. Get away from me, baby spiders. I'm poisoned. Alright, I think all the spi the big spiders are dead at least. I have some blue herbs in the thing. I just have to go back and get them. I can't name many times I've actually been poisoned in a Resident Evil game. I'm not sure if it eventually kills you or if it just weakens you or what. Bring my first aid box. Because why the hell not? Baby spiders are gone. You guys have something? Mercenary's pocketbook. September 26th. It's only been three hours since the mission started, but the team is down to me and Campbell. The number of the zombies is far greater than we expected. There is no hope left for this city. We've already injected the antibody for the virus, but I'm not sure that it will work. I don't know if I will survive. September 27th. We managed to reach the clock tower. Out of desperation, we robbed some wounded members of their weapons and used the surviving citizens as decoys. They were taught to do this in order to survive on the battlefield, but I never enjoyed it. However, a girl showed up at the clock tower before me. She is one of the survivors. She looks just like my sister before she starved to death. September 28th. I wanted to evacuate as soon as possible, but the girl didn't. Her father insisted that he wouldn't leave the city where his beloved wife rests in peace. I really wanted to save the girl, but Campbell said, All I care about is our lives. That's how I felt before, but now... The clock tower has become a dangerous place, and I don't want to make any more mistakes. Oh, hey, that's a thing. Seems that he died trying to shield someone's daughter. I mean, isn't every woman someone's daughter? Really? <laughs> that kind of goes without saying. <laughs> Past goddess. There's a tray under the picture. So I have to put something in it? Present goddess. There is a tray under the picture. Future goddess. There is a tray under the picture. 
I don't really have any items to put in there. Hello. Well, this might do it. Maiden statue holding a tray. A crystal ball is on the tray. Okay. We have three paintings and three crystal balls. Obsidian ball is on the tray. Is that like a clue, or do I have to brute force it again? I seem to be fairly good at that in this game. Amber ball. Can't carry any more items. I want that, though. That looks neat. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I want it. All made of obsidian. Okay. Well. I'm guessing black signifies death. Probably white is birth. And then gold would probably be maturation. No, I'm an hour off. Why do they turn into a math puzzle? I don't think I've ever seen a game do that. Alright, let's try putting the gold one here. I don't think that's gonna do it. Ugh. This is a really tedious puzzle to try and solve. Okay, so clearly this has to be wrong. So the black one cannot be in the far right. So let's put the white one over there. We are indeed going to brute force it, apparently. one on the left. And the gold one in the middle. Like I said, the gold has to be on the right. Basically the last combination we tried. I think there was one more after that. I wonder if there was a clue there somewhere. Gold gear. Alright, we've got silver and gold. But there was only one gear hole. Ah, oh, okay. That worked out.
Yeah, Nemesis is actually fairly disappointing. I'm sure at the time he was something else, but... I don't know, after Mr. X, Mr. X is much more dynamic. Because it's so easy to outrun Nemesis. The fact that he runs faster than you is almost inconsequential when you just go through a, like, a door or two and he just stops chasing you. Mr. X, you had to be clever and fast and... Oh, this is smoking now. Seems to have been shorted out. Okay. Go up the ladder? Yeah, hell yeah. Alright. Let's go put in our brand new gear. I still have my grenade rounds. How many grenade rounds do I freaking have? A whole bunch. You know what? In that case, let's go ahead and bring our grenade stuff. Holy shit, I do have a bunch. Uh freezing grenade. I feel a boss coming on anyway. I have three first aid kits, I don't need more. I don't even think I need the handgun right now. I only have 18 bullets anyway, that won't do too much. We kill a couple spiders, but... I think bringing the magnum as well would be overkill, but I can bring the mine thrower. Alright, 22 grenades. Six mines. Is this a safe point? With ink ribbons, hey! Maybe I will go ahead and use it. I've done enough. Got about almost 30 minutes of stuff. Always search the typewriters for ink ribbons. Alright, we've got the clock tower sounding, which if memory serves is supposed to call the person to come pick us up in the courtyard. But I'm guessing that's not going to go well. You're saved. Down here! It's finally over. Huh? camera <laughs> almost wish he had splattered into pieces just a bunch of body parts that was a long cutscene actually
did anything for me. Oh my god! That is just obnoxious! Oh, oh. <laughs> well, I was right! We're a nemesis. We got a boss battle going on. Plenty of healing, that is for damn sure. I'm just still torn between the grenade launcher and the magnum. Now let's try the mine thrower this time. I haven't even used it yet. Does it actually lay mines down or does it like explode at enemies? We'll find out. Be kind of cool if it just launches whirling discs of death and blow it up, blow up in this. Can't skip this part. What did that even do? I think it missed. Oh, it's just a delay. this gun. The lay on it this virus. I'm infected? I didn't know that was a thing that could happen. Because of that, I can't tell if... I can't tell what my health is. See, that is just cheap. Yeah, like I was gonna think you were dead. I know what my health is, but...
Jill! Jill! Hey, don't die on me. Jill! Jill! October 1st, night. I woke up to the sound of falling rain. I can't believe I'm still alive. Uh. It looks like our roles have been reversed from when we originally met, huh? Don't worry, Jill. This chapel is safe. I've been infected by the virus, haven't I? Hey! Take it easy. I'm okay. Don't feel any pain. But that's what bothers me. If I can't feel anything, then what does that mean? Don't give up, Jill. I'll take care of you. Whatever you do, don't let that virus beat you. Okay. That reminds me a lot of Code Veronica. I think this is the exact same thing there. Just about. Merc's handgun, ink ribbon, assault rifle. If I turn into a zombie, don't hesitate. I want your word. That you'll kill me. Well, he doesn't care about what you want. Right. Does he have access to her stuff? Nope. I'm kind of okay with that, actually. He does have ink ribbon, so we can go ahead and save. I should probably be saving in different slots. Is that the same one over and over? That's okay, though. <laughs> okay, where the hell are we? Alright. Where am I trying to get to? Not a bad ammo spread. Right. For now, I guess I'll go out to the courtyard where the helicopter crashed. Maybe that's where I'm supposed to go? Pillars are collapsed and the door won't open. So much for that. Right, only one door to go in. Okay, guys, we're going this way. explain why all those zombies appeared earlier if we're supposed to go this way.
Okay. Hey, I just found the cure to the T virus. It was so easy. Nothing in here, so I just wasted ammo on those dogs. Back up to the clock tower, maybe? There's only so many places to go. need to kill him. I never came back and got this thing, did I? God damn it. I can push it. Hopefully it's still there when Jill comes through here. I'm gonna save that for Jill anyway. Alright. We have another door this way. simple lock, so bring the lock pick. Forty four percent running low on ammo. If I take it with him, will she not have access to it? I might need it, though. I mean, she has plenty of healing stuff. She can. I think she has enough first aid sprays to fill up her box again. I cannot see the room next door. Patients suffer from gangrene and congestion of their blood at first, then their mind slowly deteriorates. In the end, there is nothing left of their mind. 
When that happens, even mercy killing seems pointless. After all, they are already dead. This disease is unlike anything I've ever witnessed. Once the patient's mind is gone, they become flesh-hunger monsters and act like wild animals who are on some type of bloodlust. Another patient has been admitted to the hospital. He is showing symptoms of the first stages of the disease at this point, but I haven't been able to sleep at all these past few days. I refuse to let these patients become zombies. I am not just an ordinary citizen, I am a doctor. Even if I die, my clinical charts will contribute to finding a cure. We lost most of the doctors and staff during the battle against the zombie patients. It's impossible to maintain the hospital under these conditions, and I know that it's too late for me. I'm beginning to feel that same itchy and hungry desire that all of my patients felt. It's too late for me. Alright. Tape recorder. I guess I need a tape. <laughs> Show of hands, who here remembers tapes? <laughs> Cassette tape? What the hell? I used to work music and stuff on tape. That's like weird, man. Here's someone has already searched here. You don't say. Okay, I'm guessing, yeah, him taking it has kind of screwed her. That's okay, she has plenty of ammo for other guns. But if he runs out of ammo for his machine gun, at least he'll have some for the handgun. Can I go in here? Voice recognition lock. Enter your voice. There also appears to be a slight fracture in his right arm just below the elbow. However... Simple puzzle. I dig it. going? Oh, no, it's not going. Uh, basement? If you're looking for the cures to weird viruses, always go to the basements, right? That's where they're hidden. Extreme caution is needed when handling chemicals. No idea. Another guinea pig was still alive. What are you doing? Have you lost your mind? Sometimes it's easy to forget one's loyalties. Just like that traitor. You mean the guy who shot you? Yeah, you know him. The one with the gray hair and the ugly mug. Traitor! You mean Nikolai? What the frick was that? There was a There was a bomb in the safe. You open the safe and there was a bomb in it. That was weird. <laughs> it's a high precision microscope. Is there going to be like lab science things here? Take the medium base. 
Yep, I'm gonna be making medicine. Lovely. Excuse me, electric power supply switcher. It's set next to the cultivation tank. Can we switch the electric power supply? Synthesizer of chemicals. Medium base can be set here. Okay. Can you operate the synthesizer? What exactly is my goal? B or also could you not fit all of the options on one row The vaccine medium. Okay. We have a medium vaccine. Probably need to do something with that now. Cultivation medium used to make vaccine. It needs to be mixed with the vaccine base to create the vaccine. Bellog Medical Service, North America Division, Douglas Rover. In order to activate the synthesizer to cultivate the vaccine, please follow the procedures detailed below. 1. Supply enough energy to the system. 2. Set the medium base to the device. When the device is ready, you can start mixing the vaccine medium. To make the vaccine, you need to control the five levers. I already did this. <laughs> Literally. I just did that. When are those hunters going to come leaping out and go, Rawr! It's going to happen. I don't know about the RAR part. Uh, I thought that was the door for a second. Alright, let me get to the menu. There we go. Okay. They didn't want to let me go. Oh, door's right here. God damn it. <laughs> you guys are so panicked, I missed the door. I don't care about you. I guess I use the thing here? Nope. Alright, this one? Nope. Beakers and flasks. Right, I don't have the vaccine made yet. But where the hell is this? Like, medium thing I needed. There's another part of the vaccine I need, but I don't know where it is. Quoth the raven, nothing more. Maybe they were cultivating a part of a creature's cells here.
various things and other things and blah blah. What was he even looking for? Like, the mercenary unit was hired by Umbrella to, I guess, silence the friggin' witnesses? I don't know, maybe. Makes sense to me. time to go up. Ah. Ah. Those being on the wall is always ominous. body. He's holding a slip. The number is 531 or printed on the slip. 531. Let's try to remember that. Oh, yeah, I figured. No, oh, fuck you! Alright, those herbs, I really want to save for... No, but I do have already used my healing item. I don't know if there's like a boss for him. Something seems to have been placed here. Is it still there? <sighs> it's locked. The sign reads 402. Sure that you return the materials to their original positions after inspection. I need those. All right. I don't know how far I am from the end of his scenario here. Can't be too far, right? I'm pretty sure Jill comes this way too, so they wouldn't have you go too terribly far. Sick room key. Photo D. The zombies are walking. It says the effect of the T virus on the backside. Wouldn't it be G virus and because this takes place around the same time as two, so it'd be G virus, right? Cardboard box with chemicals in it. Oh, God damn. So I've looked everywhere. Where's the other half of the vaccine I needed? 
have to be around somewhere. Unknown creature is a soaked in formalin. Medicine science, you don't say. <laughs> seen the freaking save points in a while. What the heck does 531 mean? Can I go back to the first floor now? Is that it? I forgot if I searched the whole first floor. Might not have. He's just trapped in the elevator now. Uh. Oh, that's a safe point. I think I just didn't use it before, did I? But I only have half the vaccine. This was a save room. Alright, let's go ahead and save for now. Fuck it, we're going all the way. He's at caution. I didn't even notice that. Oh. We'll deal with that next time. <laughs> Later.